Hello! Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is super exciting. These are my favorite kind of videos to watch and also the my most viewed um, videos. I'm so excited to share with you my what's in my bag video for 2023. So this year I am changing up my bag. Um, I still will use the ones I already have, but this is the new setup for this year. So if you haven't been to my channel yet, welcome. My name is Holly from Life with Holly Lifestyles. I'm so excited to share with you my life as an entrepreneur and my tips and tricks for business. And this year I'm going to do more desk setup videos, productivity videos, Notion, all that fun stuff. So if you haven't been subscribed yet, make sure you subscribe and let's get into this video. So before I get started, I wanted to mention the last setup video I did. It was with the Kuyana Easy Tote. It was the bigger tote bag like this. I will link it in the cards up above in the description down below if you haven't watched it yet. But this was the tote that I was using and I'm still using this to this day, but I like to switch things up a lot. So that's why I'm going to share my 2023. Um, but this one is really, really easy. It just looks like this. This was actually a gift from Kuyana. Um, I believe I was on their IG stories and they were kind of asking a question and then they're like, oh, we'll send some people totes. And that's kind of how I got this tote. It wasn't even an influence once again, which I thought was super cool. Um, but yeah, I love the quality. I carry this super, super heavy and the straps are like really, really well made and I don't see any problem. And it looks pretty much brand new and I've been using it nonstop every day for the past few months. So that's great to know, but let's get into the new tote. So here is the new tote here. This is the Kuyana System Tote Bag. I purchased this with my own money. Um, the reason why I got it was I always had an eye on it for the past year. And then when they sent me the Kuyana Easy Tote, I was like, okay, maybe I don't need it anymore because I already have another tote bag. Um, but they did have kind of like a most love sale and they were selling these with the sale and they were like 25% off, which they never do. So I jumped the bandwagon. Um, they, what I love about this tote bag is that there's two different sizes. I got the smaller one, but it also has a lot of accessories that you can customize this tote. I don't have any of the accessories because this can be priced but I do believe um, the cost reflects the quality and the, and the look and everything. So I'm going to slowly collect those items. Items such as um, things that you can clip in the center to add more storage. You can have kind of like a pouch here that you can put here but also use on its own. You can even have things like shoulder straps or straps in general to carry in different ways um that's what i love about it in so many different ways um but yeah so i just have it without any of that stuff because i am going to be saving my time i think i want to go to the actual store to kind of see it so if i'm in california or anything um that would be better to kind of see exactly what i want because they um do add up but I'm excited to share with you on this. Um, and Kuyana, if you're watching, please sponsor me. <laughs> I would love to add stuff in here, but it is, can get really pricey. So the one I have here is the, um, I believe it's the caramel color. I will link it down below for you guys, just in case you like this color. Also, um, I don't have a bag in this color, so that's why I chose this color. So as you see inside, it's just a really big, area for you. This one's a little more structured than my Easy Tote because it does have um, these bottoms while the Easy Tote is just kind of flops down. This bag does flop down too but um, it's a little bit more structured especially when you put stuff in there. So if I wanted to bring my iPad 12 I can actually put in there but for this setup video I'm not going to put it in there. That's something you can know that you can actually put that in there. So first thing I have is in this slot over here there's like a little pocket. I just have a hand sanitizer. This one is the Touchland Glow Mist and then I have some tissues in here because we always need tissues in our lives especially when we spill stuff and then I have two of my productivity items which is my planner and my ipad mini so instead of bringing my ipad around usually that stays at home it's more for if i need to work in the living room and i want to bring my laptop out um there's that but i love bringing this because i usually bring my laptop wherever i go now since i am working 
at home and in office at the same time so I would bring that around a lot um, so iPad mini is perfect because I can do digital planning if I want um, I can watch a video if I want um, it's just nice and compact and ready to go and I can still access all my notion all my productivity apps in here and then I have my planner this is the work week agenda this is actually from my shop um, it's a sister company of point hun which is super cute and um, it is in the content planner I did ha I did do a planner um, set up video for 2023 so I'll link that up in the cards down below so you can check it out um, but yeah so there's my planner in my iPad in there I mix both digital and physical planners together then I have this little pouch um, this is from Kuyana I actually have the bigger pouch that's in the easy tote I believe that was also in that setup video so here's how they look side by side the one is the bigger one and one is a smaller one this one I believe is in the stone gray stone color and then this one matches the easy tote that I have which is I believe cappuccino but I'll link these down below so you can go um, see so since it is a smaller tote bag I wanted a smaller setup this stuff in here is kind of like my essentials when it comes to um, having my purse with me because there's like random things that I always need and these are my essentials so first thing I have is the well-kept um, screen cleansing towelettes these are perfect to just kind of clean glasses clean my screen on my laptop a lot of things you can do with it then I have a hand cream hair this one I've heard on Sephora's the 54 Thrones um, hand and body butter heard it's really really nice so I'm excited to try this out um, so everything in here is pretty much brand new because I just set it up for this video and for this year And then we have my tower 28 SOS spray. This is a must-have No matter what because this saves my life Especially when my face is feeling really dry or my eyes are really dry You spray it and it feels a lot lot better and especially when you have redness and everything that really helps too. Then we have eye drops. I've tried a handful of eye drops and I think this one is my favorite. Um, you can get it at Costco. You can also get it at any drugstore. So this one's actually really, really good and I enjoy that a lot. And then another really important thing to have is Aquaphor. This one um, is a lifesaver, especially just throughout the day. You just have a dry skin. You need to basically freshen up, just help with the little patches on your face. Um, and I had just always have a bigger tube in my bigger bag, um, but a little tube in smaller bags. So there's that. And then we just have a hair tie here. Anything super simple works. And then last but not least, we have lippies. I have these two here. This one is the road one. I've been loving it a lot. And then Summer Fridays um, Butter Lip Balm is my favorite and I'm so happy they got, they came out with a mini version and I love it. It fits in my small purses too and I would switch it back and forth. So that's basically it in this pouch. I also like how this pouch has like a little card slot for you so you can even use this as a little clutch if you want and I just really, really enjoy it. The quality of these um, bags are amazing and I'm so in love. After I just have some smaller things, I have my Baegu. This is my favorite print from Baegu. This is their reusable bags. I always need this because now prices for plastic bags are really, really expensive and paper bags are expensive. So it's nice to always have some sort of reusable bag in there just in case you buy a lot of things. And then I have my wallet. This is a coach wallet that was on sale. Super cute. I love the um, style of this and the color and my mom bought it for me for my birthday. So this is how it looks inside. You have four card slots on this side you have another slot over here you have one in the back which is nice for easy access um, and then you just have this area for cash and um, coins with the zippy area so I love it I love my slim wallets they are absolutely my favorite love slim wallets so there's that and then last but not least we have in here is another Kuyana pouch I actually purchased this one and this one recently just for my um, bag setup so I'm so excited to have these um, I had an eye on these for a while now these are like the smaller version of their travel cases and I always like things small so when they came out with these again during the holidays I think they only come out in the holidays I had to pick one up this fits my um, temporary kind of like most used 
tech items, I guess. So I just have my AirPods in here. This is the three version, which I need a case for. And I only have two cords in here. Normally I also have a charger block in there, but I need to buy another one because I lost my other one. Um, so we have the phone cable to charge my phone, obviously. And then um, the USB-C to USB-C, a lot of my stuff charges with this anyways. Um, and obviously my laptop charges with this. So it fits in here super nicely, super compact. Um, I don't have to carry too, too much things. And that's pretty much it. So that is my what's in my bag video for this year. I'm so excited to be carrying this and obviously I'll probably purchase more bags throughout this year and I'll do another video or so in the future. But thank you for watching this video. Hope you enjoy. If you have any um, questions or any requests on videos, make sure to comment down below. And yeah, that's it for today. I'll see you in my next video. Oh, and don't forget to follow me on Instagram. I do a lot of desk setup videos there and all that fun stuff. So yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye!